we're really excited to show you Code Combat's first multiplayer PvP programming game mode. So this first match is between Samuel's code as humans in red and Vtax's code as ogres in blue. So let's see what happens here. Um, Samuel's code is very defensive, but Vtax is just leaping in there aggressively. So Vtax's targeting code is focusing on the archers and he kills those right away. Theron's using the terrifying war cry abilities to muster his troops. But Vtax just jumps and stomps, scatters Samuel's troops, and it looks like it's over. So let's go back and check out what happened. So right around here, looks like this is where the turning point occurs. So Theron is terrifying the, the brawler, and but the brawler escapes, uses Tomp just at the right time, scatters the troops, and it's over. So let's get a closer look at what VTAX is doing. I'm gonna load up my librarian strategy against VTAX's ogres. So here's the code that I wrote for my librarian on the right versus VTAX's ogre code. Well, his code is written to target archers and librarians. My code takes advantage of that and commands my minions to go straight for the enemy base. While my librarian uses a for loop over all the enemies looking for this type equals brawler. And she just uses her slow and regenerate spells to stay alive as long as possible while my soldiers kamikaze the enemy base. So I've got some conditional logic in here to decide when to cast each spell based on whether I'm about to die and what enemies are near me. And that turns out to be enough to fool Vtax's targeting. So if you want to try your hand at coding up some strategies, try the new dungeon arena map and I'll see you on the ladders.